In this video, I will explain why your website might not be appearing on Google search results and what you can do to fix it. Now, this can be frustrating, especially if you just launched your site and you're expecting it to show up right away. But the good news is there are a few clear reasons why this happens, and I'm going to walk you through them step by step. The very first thing we need to check is whether your website has even been indexed by Google. A quick way to do this is by heading over to google.com and in the search bar typing the word site, followed by a colon, and then your website's URL. For example, site colon yourwebsite.com. If no results show up at all, it means Google hasn't crawled your website yet. If you see just one or two pages, like only the home page but not the rest of your content, that means Google has started crawling but hasn't indexed everything. And if you do see all of your pages, then indexing probably isn't the issue and we'll need to look at other factors. So, if your site hasn't been indexed, the next step is making sure you've set up Google Search Console. Just search for Google Search Console, log in with your Google account, and add your website as a property. Once it's verified, you can use the URL inspection tool to request indexing. This basically tells Google, hey, come check out my site and add it to the search results. Alongside that, make sure you've submitted your sitemap, usually found at yourwebsite.com by slash sitemap.xml. This helps Google understand the structure of your site and crawl it more efficiently. Now, sometimes your site doesn't appear because of a very simple setting inside your website platform. If you're using WordPress, for example, there's a checkbox under the reading settings that says, discourage search engines from indexing this site. If that box is checked, your site will never show up on Google. So make sure it's unchecked. Even if indexing is fine, Another reason your website may not show up is weak SEO. Google doesn't just display every page, it prioritizes those that are well optimized. That means you'll want to install an SEO plugin like All-in-One SEO or Rank Math on WordPress, or use built-in SEO tools on other platforms. These plugins help you set proper titles, descriptions, and keywords for your pages, which play a big role in getting your site ranked higher. Also remember, brand new websites don't appear overnight. It can sometimes take days or even weeks for Google to fully crawl and rank a site. If you've just launched, patience is key. But to speed things up, you can create high-quality content, make sure your site loads quickly, and ensure it works well on mobile devices. Google favors websites that offer a good user experience. Another thing to check is whether your site might be blocked by a robots.txt file. This is a small file in your website's root directory that tells search engines which parts of your site to crawl or not to crawl. If it accidentally blocks the entire site, Google won't index anything. So double check that your robot's text isn't set to disallow everything. So to recap the main reasons, your site may not be indexed yet, it could be blocked by settings or files, or it might simply need stronger SEO and time to climb up the rankings. By making sure you've set up Google Search Console, submitted your sitemap, unchecked that Discourage Search Engines option, and optimized your content, you'll give your site the best chance to appear on Google. And that's it. If you follow these steps and give it some time, your website should start showing up in Google search results.